I just don't understand. channel. So today I'm going to film a little clothing haul for you. All the items that I bought are from Unique Vintage. No, I'm not sponsored at all, although that would be nice. But I have just always been so curious with the pinup style and the 1950s style. And so I thought, why not give it a go? Now let's jump straight into the haul. As always, I will provide links to all the items. Hopefully they're still available, but if they are, I will link them down below in the description box so that you guys can buy your own vintage clothing. So the first item I'll start with is what I am currently wearing. It is this beautiful, beautiful sweetheart neckline top. Um, I will have all the details here, but it is so gorgeous. It's, I got it in a black shade, but there's also, I believe, navy blue and white as well. And I've just always been so obsessed with sweetheart necklines. And I finally have a shirt that has a sweetheart neckline. It's just so hard to find. This kind of neckline is not very common, at least in modern day fashion, from what I've seen. But it's always been my absolute favorite neckline and I'm so happy with this blouse. This is probably my favorite out of all of them. So we're starting off strong. For this blouse, I could have sized down. If you are in between sizes, then I would go ahead and size down because this is quite stretchy, um, which is really good because you can get that nice snug Fit without feeling suffocated. It's almost like a spandexy kind of material. Really comfortable and really easy to wear. So I love this. And of course it's black, so it goes with pretty much everything. So yes, that's a win. On to the next item. I got this sweater shirt. <laughs> it is like a knit material, but it is so soft and comfortable. I love mustard yellow, which I never thought I would, but Yes, absolutely love this color, but I would suggest pairing this with something like, like a high-waisted jeans. Oh my gosh, that would look so cute. This is really stretchy, so again, if you're between sizes, you can size down. Uh, I always tend to size up when I'm ordering online because I hate returning things and I mean, if it's too big, then you can always get it tailored, whereas if it's too small, then, you know, that's harder to make it work. So just a tip. <laughs> so pretty and so soft and comfortable. Perfect for like a transitional piece, like for springtime or fall. Yes, I would definitely wear this during fall. The next item is a circle skirt. I've always, always wanted a circle skirt. They're just so beautiful the way they twirl around and oh my gosh. And this one is even better because it has pockets. How awesome is that? It actually has pockets and it has this beautiful like embroidery detail on the side. It is a bit too long for me, so I do have to get it to the tailor and get it hemmed. But since that's not happening anytime soon, I will have to wait and wear this. I've always been obsessed with circle skirts. I love the way they flow and move. Um, I do want to get like an undergarment, like a petticoat to wear under this so it kind of floofs out a little bit. The only thing is definitely um, getting it hemmed. It is, it does look far too long for me. And I am quite short. I'm only 5'2", so <sighs> it's a struggle that I'm familiar with. But other than that, it is this beautiful olive green. I am obsessed with olive green. If you've seen my past hauls, you know my love for olive green. I don't know what it is, but that's what drew me to the skirt. That and the fact that it was a circle skirt. So it was amazing. And then when I saw it had pockets, I was sold. And finally, I have two dresses that I got. The first one is so springtime. Oh my goodness. I definitely pictured myself wearing this maybe like on Easter Sunday or just... I don't know, it just looks so springy and happy and this color is so bright and 
just so fun. I don't have anything in my closet this color, so love that. It is a pretty good length for me. It comes with this little tie. You can of course replace it with a belt if you prefer. Pretty, it has a zip on the back so that you can fit into it. If you're looking for a fun springtime vintage inspired dress, then I would totally go for this. This one doesn't look super vintage. Um, so if you're kind of dipping your toes into you know, vintage clothing like I am, then this will definitely be a safe bet. This next dress is pretty much exactly like the blue one I just showed you, but it is that beautiful mustard yellow again. This one also came with a tie for the waist, and it's kind of like a wrap dress style. As you can see, it has like a little button here. Um, for this, it kind of folds over, and I will either have to try ironing it down a little bit or use some fashion sh tape, fashion shape fashion tape to kind of hold it down but other than that it is so pretty i love this color i used to hate absolutely hate yellow but there's something about this like golden yellow that i just love it looks so happy and pretty and i love the polka dots i was never a polka dot person but I just don't understand. And another detail on actually both of the dresses is the sleeves. I love this little sleeve detail. I think it's just so pretty and dainty and feminine and oh, just so excited to wear these out. I can't wait. All right, guys, so those are all the items that I got from Unique Vintage. I hope you guys enjoyed. As I said before, I will link all of the items or at least similar items down below in the description box, so make sure to check that out. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!